Okay, YouTube, Paul Bates here, and today we're gonna install a thin shade. Uh, we learned a lot. Uh, we bought this uh, thin shade uh, on uh, Amazon, paid about 100 bucks for it, and right now you can see we're just playing with the directions here. I'm gonna go ahead and remove this window right here. I've already started pulling some of the screws. So, Bev, can you pan around here and just kind of see what I'm doing for the back? So the old window come out, came out very easily. You can see here, I just removed the screws. And you see Bev holding the glass right there, and you just kind of pop it off, and the silicone bead just releases itself. And it was super easy to get out, not a big deal at all. You guys can see here, they, they've already provided the silicone right here, and the silicone right here on this edge, so I don't have to do anything to this. I just popped it out, I popped our old one out, and I'm just going to pop this one in. One thing we did learn here real quick is you got to make sure at silicone that your window is lined up on the outside. I, the first time I put it in, it was off a little bit and there was a little air gap. So Bev pointed it out to me and we were able to fix it really quick and pull it back out. But if you want to do it right the first time, just make sure you got an even gap. It's evenly put in there and then tape it in there. No big deal at all. Super, super easy to install. So you got to put it in like this. It was hard because the directions aren't real clear. But this is the top right here. This is the bottom. These pieces, they don't snap. They just kind of fold onto here and you'll see it when I learned here real quick is you got to have that this window has to be perfectly in there and you have to make sure you have a seal all the way around it so you just got to pay attention to it uh, Bev pointed it out just make sure you're dark in all your little corners right there once you do that you're fine so just take a second set that thing right another thing we did is we did a little cheat sheet I put a little piece of tape on there now I'll see that from the inside I didn't think I was gonna see this but I do see this from the inside here. It's just a little cheat sheet. You can also probably use a little two-way tape right inside this, this little gap right here, and it would go a little bit easier. But all I need to do is get the screw started, and then it'll, it'll take over from there. All right, so let's put it back on. And then I'll hold the other side. That looks better, right? Just kind of reach your hand around and grab, just, yeah, just, just hold the frame in there nice and easy. Something else too is these are, it's just real thin plastic, so be very, very careful with those screws. Like you can't put any tension on them at all or you'll strip them very, very easily. So. Question, should you be pushing on this to seal? It'll, it Can should grab it right now and I will in a second. What I'm going to do is take the screw gun around here and I'm going to go real nice. Okay, so we screwed it in, we've got all the, the screws in. That looks good. So you got to use both hands. You got this bit? Use both hands when you're pulling that. And we'll leave ours shut. We always. That is kind of cool though, because uh, now you can see inside and, si and outside, like in the daytime when you want it. But when the sun's coming in there, beating in there, just shut it. Pretty cool. You like it, babe? I think so. All right, YouTube, thanks for watching. Again, uh, Paul Bates, Bates Outdoor Adventures. One thing to remember, I'm a professional carpenter, so it went very, very easy for us. We've used it now on a trip, and it went extremely well. We love it. Peace out. Thank you guys for watching the videos, and be good.